Speaking of barks, it's time to meet another dog. The two dogs that need homes. John is with Dante's Den founder and host of Animal Outtakes, Marsha Panucci, with our pets of the week. Hey guys. Hi. How'd you like that on cue bark? Timing. Huh? <laughs> I'll tell you what, it's timing. Good Absolutely. job, Renee Pearl. This is Renee Pearl, right? Yes, it is. She's a two year old um, white. Uh, poodle, standard poodle, isn't she gorgeous? She is very affectionate. She's loving. Uh, she unfortunately had a bad start. She was in a loving home, uh, and her owner got a progressive illness and was then unable to take care of her. Aww. And so uh, she came to the Florida Poodle Rescue, and she's just absolutely looking for a forever couch to be on. She's two. So she's still considered puppy, and as you know, John, uh, these larger dogs remain puppy status until they hit their fourth year. So she's uh, very trainable and, of course, very, very smart and extremely affectionate and just full of life. I think she would be good in a home, though, perhaps with other dogs but maybe not exactly with other children because she is the child yeah. herself. Yeah. yeah, and she's a high-energy dog. At least she seems that way in the yes. studio. It's hard to know how they are when they're in the home right. when you have them like this, but uh, certainly a beautiful coat, beautiful dog, and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, yes, she's I'm very sure proud. She'd be a lot you of notice fun. her nails were done for the show. I see that. And she got fluffed and buffed. Yes, she did. It's and, gorgeous. And she has her beautiful bow on. This is she's one magnificent dog and that everybody we... should take a notice in. This is Milo. Um, Milo is, a, is called a phantom poodle. And a phantom poodle is one that has the characteristics of a poodle but has the markings of a Doberman. Interesting combination, I've wouldn't you say? I've never heard of such a thing, yeah. So we're kind of trying to figure out here if which part is the dobe, the front or the back? <laughs> <laughs> but uh, Milo is just an absolute wonderful, wonderful dog. He's 10 months old. Uh, he, too, uh, got himself into a home where there was a lot of chaos. And as you can see, Milo likes to take life easy and so I would make a re yes I would make a recommendation that Milo would go into a home that is very affectionate very loving but perhaps not other children but he does get along wonderfully with other dogs and he does love Renee Pearl well, we have a full screen up there for you for where you can go to uh, adopt these babies. This is the Florida Poodle Rescue, 727-525-2118. What are you saying? What are you saying? Talk to us. Talk to us. Vocal baby. Scott, I think you've got a fan club over here. I know. Or else he smells the food all the way over here. I think she, yeah, I think she might be hungry.